Are you ready to see our good friend Cubby Bear? Let's call for him together. Ready? One, two, three, Cubby! Oh, hi, everyone. Hi, Cubby. Um, are you expecting it to rain? Well, I don't know if it's supposed to rain today, but it was raining when Timothy and I were in the boat on Cubby Bear Creek, and we didn't have an umbrella. Now, I'm wearing a poncho around just in case. You never know when it might rain. Oh, Cubby, can you tell the boys and girls how you and Timothy ended up by yourselves in a boat on the creek? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, we went down to the creek to see if Timothy's toy boat would float. And when we were there, I saw Timothy's dad's fishing boat on the shore. Timothy and I started playing in the boat, and soon it slid out into the water with Timothy and me in it. That is so scary, Cubby. You and Timothy shouldn't have been down at the creek by yourselves or playing in the boat. I know. And it got even scarier when the storm came. A big wind blew Timothy's cap right off his head. Then it started raining really hard. What did you do? Well, we couldn't jump out and swim, and we weren't strong enough to use the paddles. We even tried yelling for help, but no one came. This is so scary. Hi, everyone. Hi there, lovey. Cubby, why are you wearing a poncho? The sun is out. It's not going to rain today. You never know, Luffy. When Timothy and I were in the boat, we didn't think it would rain either. But it did, and we got soaked. I want to stay nice and dry. Cubby was telling us about his adventures on Cubby Bear Creek, Lovey. Have you been to the creek? Oh, no. I try to stay away from water. My wool is not very pretty when it's wet. I'm sure you're always pretty, Lovey. But I wish Cubby and Timothy hadn't gone to the water this time. They were stuck on the boat in the storm, and they were scared. I'm sorry you were scared, Cubby. What did you do? Well, I just hugged Timothy as tightly as I could. At least we weren't alone. We were together. It always feels good to have someone with you when you're scared. Cubby, next week you're going to have to tell us how you got off that boat. I'm glad you're safe. Me too. Uh, bye, boys and girls. I'll see you later. Bye, everyone. Bye, Cubby. Bye, lovey. All right, Cubbies. Well, I am glad that Cubby Bear and Timothy are safe. And I'm glad that they weren't alone in that scary storm. They had each other. Today in our lesson, we're going to learn about a very scary storm in the Bible and how there was someone very special who let the disciples know that they were not alone either. Bye, Cubbies. We'll see you next week.